That is a risky move, sir. Oh my gosh. This works really well. <laughs> gosh! All right. <laughs> Mom, you were not kidding. Boba Fett is super strong. He's so strong to me, plus Tarzan, go. Captain Bye. America. Oh, yeah. You're Captain America? Yep. Where's your star and stripes? I didn't unpaint it yet. Oh, okay. What's, What's up, up guys? guys? It is... Turbo Toy Time. Mine is right, and this is my dad, Andy. That's true. And we did toy videos. Yes, and today we have a game, and he... And it's called Don't Drop the Meatballs. It's called Don't Drop the Meatballs. He said it when he was running in, but he quickly went into explaining that he was Captain America, which I didn't know. Good job. I'm a proud <laughs> dad. Uh, yeah, so we're playing Don't Drop the Meatballs. I saw this online. I've never seen it in a store. It maybe, it, honestly, it looks like it maybe was like from 10 years ago. I don't it know. It looks like it's from that meatball game that we did with that guy in the middle. Oh, the Yeti and the spaghetti? Mm -hmm. Yeah, kind of. What we're going to do is we're going to take this box over to the table. We're going to show you everything about this. Get it out. Figure we're out how to play. Figure out how to play, then play with it. Exactly. That's what we're going to do. Who do you think's going to win? Me. You? Me. Oh, oh yeah, of course. What do, you, do you have muffin on your face? Yeah. You have a blueberry muffin on your face. All right, take, I'll take this. You go wash your face, and uh, we'll get this video started in a second when Ryden does not have blueberry on his face. This is like the exact color of your shirt. Watch the screen. Oh. <laughs> uh, and that's a new pancake attack shirt. Yep. It's got a dinosaur and it's got a skateboarding cat. And there's a unicorn. Oh, there's another shirt. Yeah, we released new shirts recently, uh, which you can get at pancake-attack.com. It's uh, right down there, but either way, let's, let's get to this game. Yeah. Um, this is don't drop the meatballs. meatballs. Pull out the spaghetti, but don't let the meatballs fall. Okay, this is weird. First off, this is like a flat kerplunk, right? Do you remember kerplunk where the marbles drop? Well, let's name these people. What's, what's his name? Jax. That's Jax. And that video, and her name's gonna be Natasha. Okay. For Black Widow. Uh, but this is by Pressman Games. Uh, it's, it's four kids. And the ages is five and up, and it's two to four players. Boom. And we both, there's two of us, and we're both over five. Well, we can play, we can play, um, like, full players if we have, like, stuffed animals in there. <laughs> yes. If you guys have some extra stuffed animals, you could totally play with two stuffed animals and two people. But I do want to point out that it feels like, 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 I feel like a game shouldn't make that sound. Like, it's, they just threw it in the box, they didn't put any packaging. Uh, kind of weird, but no judging just yet. Uh, let's flip it around though, and this is where it kind of makes me confused. It says don't drop the meatballs, but they just drop onto a plate. So I'm, I, I, I'm gonna read the instructions. I don't know if it means it falls off the plate or if yeah. it just like, you know? So it, I'm confused, but Look. we're gonna play this meatball game. So they take it out, but it falls off. Maybe that's what this. Yeah, there is a little picture of it like, falling off the plate. It says, "Look at the pile of plastic strings and decide which one you'll try to pull out. Carefully pull out the strand of spaghetti. If you make a meatball drop, you have to take it." And the, um, I think the person with the least amount of meatballs at the end. Oh, maybe, you know what, you might, it might say that right here. If it gets more challenging on every turn, when all the meatballs have fallen, the player has collected the fewest meatball wins. Okay. <laughs> I'm crazy, sorry. Uh, yeah, but still, we don't know if it's off the plate or just if it's resting on the plate. I don't know. This is not a 10-year-old game. This is from 2017. It says right there. It's, it's got a barcode. It's got a, the, basically the graphic on the side is the front of the box squished into one. It's literally this picture squished into the side. Same with the top. Same with the other side, same with that side, and then this just hides right in his face. But that's it! That is the box! Oh, no, we are donating this toy. We're not gonna beat up the box. He asked uh, when I turned the camera off, he was like, Can I please Hulk smash open the box? That's what I did last time. That was your box, though. That was like yeah. your toy that you'd gotten you back for your birthday. It perfectly. You did. And it, honestly, it didn't even it didn't even mess the box up. You just kinda like punched it and it opened. <laughs> there we go. I just want to point out that look, it like literally, like this box could have been this big. This is why it was shaking around. It looks like a meal already. It was just like on the plate, ready. Don't eat this. Don't eat this, right? Mm -hmm. I should say that. It would just have to be like that. All right, so you open this and do not bounce those meatballs everywhere. This is just, what is, what is going on here? Can I bounce one? Oh, okay, look. Look right in there. Does that stay? No, it doesn't. Yeah, you have to sit on the table. Yeah, this is weird. Okay, there we go. The assembly for this game takes literally five seconds. Wow, that's like a bouncy ball. They're red too. Okay, they color. Well, yeah. I guess if they were brown, it'd be more normal, like a meatball. All right, so it's kind of like a curvy plate. You guys, can you guys see that slant? That's how it falls off because I get it. All right, this game is, is the legit. It's 
legit legit. I get it. I'm not confused anymore. So, so we just like pile these on. I feel like, this is weird. I felt like they would be. I like, love these. The, I love the favorite. I'm trying to set it up. You just stole all the spaghetti. <laughs> Put the spaghetti back on the plate. They feel so cool. Put the spaghetti back on the plate. They feel so cool. I thought it was gonna be like a hard plastic, but they're kind of rubbery. <laughs> Dude, that one's coming off immediately. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be the quickest game ever. All right, if that was your meal, how silly would this look? It look this, they really look like tomatoes. Okay, I tried to read the instructions, and the instructions are literally pretty much what it said on the back of the box we read already, so let's get to playing. Does it say satisfying. the first player goes first? This looks satisfying. Like, in an eating sense? You'd want to eat that? It kind of looks like real spaghetti. Don't eat that. <laughs> I know you were joking, but out there, do not put toys in your mouth. It's just not, it's just, it's just not a safe thing. <laughs> Starting with the youngest player. So you get to go first, all right? Uh, so you literally just try to find one piece of spaghetti, and you pull it out. And if any meatballs fall, you're out. you keep them. Well, you're not out. You get to keep them. And whoever has the least meatballs at the end, uh, wins. So do you understand how to play? Okay. It is your turn, sir. You're the youngest. You're, you're pulling from the other side? You're gonna, you're gonna dump all of the- you didn't dump any of the meatballs. Okay. So it's my turn now. I'm gonna pull this guy and hopefully so not- satisfying. Dude. Okay, it's working pretty good. I got a noodle! I, I've got a noodle! I got hair. Don't- well, yeah, it does. You got noodle hair. Alright, go. Your turn. New hair instead of noodle hair. Like you're gonna pull the whole spaghetti! No, you've gotta come. No. Okay, no, no more of that. Yeah, if you yeah. touch a noodle, you have to take it, okay? Like your plug. I'm taking this one. I'm, oh, that one wasn't doing anything for anybody. I got a noodle. Oh, right, go. I don't know what I'm gonna do. That is a risky move, sir. Oh my gosh. This works really well. <laughs> gosh! Alright. <laughs> Alright. This is gonna, this is a bad idea. This is a really bad idea. What is going? Yes! <laughs> this is this works way better than I thought it was gonna. All right, go. That's a risky one. What was that? You just got a meat. You just got a meatball. All right, I'm gonna. You're gonna oh. admit you, son. Dude, please. <laughs> yes! Oh my gosh! Yes. Good luck, sir. You, you gotta take it. You no! have to take that one. I told no! you. Just pull it this way. You'll be all right. <laughs> oh no! Are you sure? Yeah, you didn't. You literally didn't touch any of the meatballs. Okay. Um. Let's see if this bad boy does anything. Oh my gosh! I got so lucky. Maybe that's the way to do it. Just like, or like one of these, right? In, oh no! I don't know. That one's touching oh, that. Yeah. Okay. That was literally touching nothing, Ryden. <laughs> that was not you, fair. You're gonna get I'll touch this meatball one. Soon. Dude, I'm getting super lucky. You don't know. At this point, it's like... How? <laughs> How did that stay? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna take this guy. What? This is insane. Can you guys see this? These meatballs are cliffhanging. Sure. They're, they're all gonna fall off. What? <laughs> Right here. No! Yeah, one at least. I actually got two noodles too. Dude, it's like, it basically comes down to whoever, I got a meatball. Whoever can, like, actually, if you look closely, there's probably one that's not touching those. Oh, I see one! Very carefully, because even if you shake this plate, you just got all the meatballs. That was a quick you, game. I know. Dude, you you could have won if you would have carefully pulled it that way because it wasn't told touching me those. You to do it. I did, but I didn't tell you to knock them all that way. That was so quick. <laughs> that was very quick. There was don't drop the meatballs. Mm -hmm. Is it don't drop the meatballs? Yeah, don't don't, yeah. don't drop the meatballs. Okay, when I when I had the box and I shook it and it just it felt cheaper when we opened it. I was like, uh, this is like literally like just like a whatever toy. It's, it's fun. Really fun. Okay, so the second I won the first game, he won the second game, and it was it, we didn't film it. It was completely the opposite. Like you got one meatball and then and I got, the, got rest. the rest. But it, 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 like whatever, if you get the unfortunate one that like, topples it all, like you lose. Uh huh. But it's fun. Like, it works really well, and uh, I don't know, it, it was like, I was excited to play a second time, and I would play again. But we're, of course, going to donate I wanna this. I want this game. Well, then you can, uh, you have some birthday money saved up, or your piggy bank. You can use that and buy it yourself. But we are going to donate this one, and uh, good job, Pressman. This was a fun toy. I'm, it's, it, there's not a lot 
uh, of a material in it, so I would hope that this isn't more than like 10 bucks if you actually found it at a store. If you want to uh, get a copy of it, you can always find it online. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. We had a good time. I give this, uh, I give this game, especially if it's 10 bucks, I think it'd be a good deal for a fun game. I give it two thumbs up. That's a lot. Of, that's all of our thumbs. But thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you want to see more videos from us, what would they do, Raiden? Hit the subscribe button right down below. Yeah, uh, and if you want to be notified immediately when we upload a video, mm -hmm. hit the subscribe button right down below. The bell. Hit that little tiny. That's baby. the one I'm talking about this time. Uh, that, but and we would appreciate that. We love making videos, and uh, we thank you for watching them. Um, if it's nice outside, go outside and play. Yes. If it's not, you could always do something creative inside. And that's it. I'm gonna yeah. play soccer today. Yeah. It looks. It's disgusting outside, but I, I think the sun's gonna come out, and he has a soccer game. Or if you live anywhere else in the world, football. Football. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, yeah, you guys have a great day, and we'll see you very soon. Uh, Boba Fett now has a lightsaber and uh, okay, never mind. Boba Fett cannot hold the lightsaber, but he's, he's gonna say peace. He needs someone to say out. His puppy dog will say out. Out. That dog can speak English? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>